Wow, Lunala! Got a lot more damage than your old version! Yeah, your old version kinda stunk. And uh, this one, ooh, wow. You can even take out God of War GX! Here, and uh, let's go ahead and use Lunar Javelin! Why can't I use Requiem? Because I don't got the energy to use it. That's right! You're back again? Well, I guess you do kinda fit. Hmm. Starting up today, man! Turbo Strike! The oh, Both of these all in one deck going together? Yeah! Okay, so now it's like, hey, Donald, get out of me! Yeah, I can Lunar Javelin next and then take out this guy right here. Wow, that Lunala looks delicious! Well, hello, Nervous! And the French Rolls, it's Dom. Welcome back to my kitchen. And on today's menu, I'll be serving you the Lewis Lunala GX. The promo Lunala with Lunar Javelin. Yeah, it's a lot stronger than the other one. So let's get started. Let's jump into it. Okay, so first of all, you engineers, you're like, give me the essential information. How does this work? All right, Lunala GX, main attacker. 200 damage attack, which you'll be using with the choice man. Yeah, it's got four energy initial cost. You can see a DC right here. And an ongoing cost of two energies every time you use this. How do you fix that energy discard deal? We use the new Sokaleo from yesterday, who gets two basic energies back onto your Lunala. Ah, so you can see how there's a repeating combo here. All right, so we just got to pay for the last part, the retreat cost. And those of you, you're already familiar with this, right? Invasion and the Altar of the Moon retreat combo. So pretty much there is a combo and everything's gonna be paid for afterwards. And you have some bonus energy uh, acceleration through these cards here. You veterans, you already know what these cards does. You know what the combo is. So in that case, yep, I'll see you. And for everybody else, like, don't know, give me the analogy. Tell me a story. You got it, here we go. So I actually go start with Dr. Sogaleo. Cause you saw him yesterday. So his story is continues today. Well, Dr. Sogaleo's married, okay? And then for a refresher, this is what Doctor does. GX! He holds up all Pokemons back to full life. He's a doctor. And he cures them of their weakness. They're allergic to something? Boom. Not allergic anymore. Fire? Boom. Not anymore. So, uh, Turbo Strike. So now, you know, he's got a... He likes to prescribe nutrient stuff for his patients. He does two hit KOs. He's a doctor. He isn't, you know, an assassin. And he gets some two basic energies from the discard. Onto your Pokemon, to your bench! He feeds them! Great! And what about his wife? Well, his wife likes to spend money. <laughs> that was a bad analogy, but let's keep going with that. So, Lunar Javelin, when she has a lot of money, four energies, she's gonna spend some. Discard two energies, ah, but hey, it buys two hit KOs. It buys very valuable stuff for this game that's worth it. You're gonna boost that up with a choice man here. Oh, that's not golden. I don't got any golden ones in this account. So 30 more damage, that's 230. And that gets out things like Garden War GX. Perfect, and she also can, you know, she's got connections. She could use a one-time deal of Requiem GX, 250. That gets everything out. Or 280 with a choice man, which really gets everything out. Resistance, whatever. So, and she also, you know, she flies. She's got free retreat. And if she's on a budget, oh well, glide, 50 damage. That's okay. And you can see there's a shared double colorless energy cost between them. So that's your wife and husband combo. What are they supported by? Well, there's this imposter Ludology X. And he's mainly here for his invasion retreat free combo. So he's holding one of these energies. And there's a stadium called Altar of the Moon Up. He gets free retreat. And he will use his ability to jump into the front. And then you can retreat with the free retreat to any other Pokemon. And that's how you are going to rotate between using uh, the wife, Ludala GX, and the husband, Sogaleo GX. So when she's out of energies, switch and do Turbo Strike. Now she can only retreat for free, so it's just about getting the husband back out. So that's part of it. All right, and there's a little helpers that get you energies here. We got Shiny Mew, Legendary Guidance. You can look for any two energies cards. This includes double colors energies and put them to your Pokemon. This helps you get energies at the start, and Lunala Brimstar gets you later in the game. When the energies are your discard, yes, I know Brimstar Sogaleo can do it. But this is a basic, this is a backup. And she's also very strong too. Psy Storm, 
all the energies in the game added together, your opponents included, deal 20 damage. It's really strong, but we're using DCs here, so it's kind of hard to get that going. Alright, so is there anything special about this deck I'd like to point out? I think that's about it. A lot of it is just going to the setup, the trainers that you need, so... I'm gonna leave it there. Ms. Lana, you're today's star. You think this is gonna work? Oh, you bet it is. Here we go. Choose the Pokemon to be your active. Don't mind. <laughs> like I said, uh, you know, we need you for Buzzwall. For our Sogaleo to get Buzzwall, but since we have this guy, we don't need that. Because he'll hit for weakness. So we'll say it up on you. Unless I just want to really want to thin you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I like this. I can hit you for weakness damage, which makes me like, yeah! yeah. Okay, so let's play. I'm going to play Burn from Tales of Berseria. We're going to be playing, uh, I think we're going to be playing, uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey after this Pokemon stream, so hang from that. <laughs> maybe you might be into that, maybe not, but we'll focus on right now. Lunala, Lunala, Lunala. Let's play Thin. Love Nest Balls. Of course you do. That's your main Pokemon. Cosmog. All right, nothing else. Will you drop the Delmise down? Yes. No. No. I'm going to Ultra Bot later. But hopefully he doesn't come back to my hand all the time. It's like, oh, well, we'll take it out of your deck next time. That's true. Banana Master, worth it. Come down now. Energy, worth it. Come down now. Could be a rare candy. Hang up. Is it rare candy? No. Darn. Leave the baby up front. Totally okay. Don't want to risk uh, anything here. Save this for next turn. Uh, okay, going pretty safe so far. What we, what we, what do you really want to do next turn? Uh, it's tough. It's tough. I might just attach another energy here, and then once the big Lunala comes out, we can just one shot this. Or we could use our big other Sogaleo. So right now we're pairing these two up right here. These two are in my deck right now at the same time. Let me hold them still. Yeah, you two. I hope you guys work well together. Okay, stop shaking it. I have a, I have a tendency to do that. I mean, I got you guys. I got you guys out of the theme decks. Uh, I bought your boxes, so here we go. Time to get value. Okay. Just, you guys or in the video are like, Hey, doll, you pulled Rick Watson GX. How come you talk about Mount Barbecue Master? Because he's my man, man. He's my man. Oh, man. Field Blower. Speaking of that, let's focus back on the game right here. Field Blower. Lily, eight card full. All right. I hope you're not the energy discard kind. I don't think so. I mean, you got a Gardevoir. There are uh, energy discard variants, though. So I'm going to send the Eevee out. Probably going to evolve this right here. Oh, he did not get energy. That is unlucky. Well, he did have the Ultra Ball, so. Okay, what are we going to do here? We're a Lily because if we Lily rare candy, we're gold. Balls. Balls. Well, plan B. Plan B. Use the stage two evolution. Who cares if you don't get any of your four rare candies or order pad? You still got this version here. And then we can figure out what we evolve after that. All right, so we're gonna go ahead. Banana Master always got me, man. Always got me. That's okay. Leaving this guy up front, it's okay. He got no energies, I think. Oh, I'd rather retreat this and not worry about the retreat. So we'll leave it there, man. We will leave it there. He's not playing the right cards for Sylphie on Meal. I hope so. I hope so. It looks like he did have Sylphie on his hand. It is up. We can one-shot that. But we need, in order for our combo to be truly complete, we need the we need the other version too. We need him to evolve. I hope that happens soon. I hope I pull DC as well, so otherwise we're in trouble. Both of us are playing stage two. You can see we're both slow. So we are both slow, slow. <laughs> I mean, if this is the base of stage two decks. Oh man, just stick with stage one. Pokemon, you're still gonna make your stage two better. I got a little bit of coffee left. Drink it, because you're not gonna go sleep tonight. I want to go to sleep tonight. I got to finish the coffee now. Holy cow, that sucks. I don't want you to kill my baby. Don't kill my baby. Let's put the energies up. 
You really could have evolved and started attacking into the big line one shot that. The big line's the best thing I have that I can get right now. This lion. This lion should be out now, but he didn't, but he might have a chance later, so. Alright. Uh I have four of those, four ultra balls, some order pads. Sometimes it just doesn't happen, alright? So we'll wait for the next Cynthia. I just need to exactly draw one of those cards. Alright. Leaving it be. This is where we the weakness damage is gonna bring me a lot more value than uh fighting trying to fight with the new card. With the new guy. Cause I have weakness damage. And that's not really fair, but let's go. It's like I gotta go to sleep. Put down the coffee, you drink coffee. Well, I gotta drink it all now. I'm gonna sleep in six hours, man, so or Yeah, six hours. Let's go. Alright, clear! That's all the caffeine, okay, buddy. That's all the oh, caffeine you get. Stop feeling tired and feel, give me all the energy I can get. Water now. Because that makes you thirsty. Cynthia, please evolve me one of my sexy lions. All right, now I need a switch now. I'll just juice toss you. I mean, are you gonna be tails or heads? You can't kill my babies now. They're not babies no longer. It's too bad we wasted energy on this. I wouldn't say it's wasted, but we definitely could have got a KO by placed energy here. I wasn't thinking, so yeah, that's right. No, you weren't thinking. You weren't thinking. Let's get another final Cosmog out. Cause, oh my gosh. We're leaving it there. All right, so we're nicely set up. We can do 130 damage with our Turbo Strike here. And we also have Prominence GX as well. And either way, I just need a choice man here to get the KO, and I might try it. Well, we'll see. We'll see. It's got two Gardevoirs up. It's Gardevoir versus Sogaleo. Doesn't this look cool? Holy cow. He's got... <laughs> That's not good. Don't have a prison boost energy. I need a Guzma bad. Guzma? Oh, they're on my deck. I might pull it. I might pull it. Let's see what we get, though. Chug, chug, chug. Give more water in, man. Water is life. Let's see what he does. He cannot get a one-shot KO on any of my Pokemons. I'm very tanky. I do not have a free retreat right now. So this is why I have to pay this energy, right? Sexy. Very sexy. There's only one Pokemon that can take this out one shot. That's you. Put the energy here, because she'll be attacking next. Instruct. Choice man, you'll need that to KO a Gardevoir, so I'll hold that and not let him take take it. Turbo Strike! Yeah! We did, I'm sorry to abuse the weakness damage, buddy, but that's how it is. Hey, wait a minute! You don't need the energies, you do. It's just discard two psychic energy. Oh, don't load up too many energies, because that makes the Gardevoir more powerful. So we're going to load it back here. I like this better than my Solgaleo GX deck. I like you better. I don't know why. It's like, you know, I'm not as strong as Sogaleo. Why? Leave it there. Don't say anything just yet. Don't say anything just yet. We are abusing weakness damage for sure here. But not like, well, okay, I'll, I'll stop cheating. I'll go ahead and go back to this. No more cheating, Donald. You're going to fight the normal way. Let me see. We got, I think that's the only Cosmo. We need the rare candies to get the other pulls here. All right, he's gonna go for a two hit. And in the meantime, he's gonna load up the Gardevoirs. And yeah, I took out his biggest Gardevoir because Guzma came through. So we're gonna try to set up one more right here. That's half, that's not half my life. 
I'm not powerful. Okay. We got another Guzma. Let's go ahead and go for the bench. Whee! Woohoo! Yippee! Make sure I have an infinite retreat here. And uh, let's go ahead and use Lunar Javelin. Why can't I use Requiem? Because I don't got the energies to use it. That's right. Take Liza, Shining Mew. Don't even need the Shining Mew this game. Would have been nice to start off with you, but that is okay. In the front, that is. All right. I missed the chance with both stage two. We're on the bench. Uh, yep. Yep. And he can't use the super boost, which is dangerous because that's four energies. Speaking of boost, which we probably could use that. That might be the only way to activate Requiem GX easily. So, we need one more prize card, but we can just easily retreat and attack with this. So, basically, a combination of weakness damage and that it, this thing is pretty strong. It really dominates the lower, weaker GX guards and stuff, so... Well, no more bench lines for me unless I get the pal pad. Uh-oh, he played a Guzma. He's like, I'm gonna get this line out. That probably is the smartest move. Guzma, kill the lion! Can he? Can he? That's the best move! Oh, smart! Uh, he can! He can slay the lion! Alrighty then! So, I mean, I got a free retreat here, but let me see what I can do here with this. You countered me. You countered me. Good job. You stopped me from taking the win. I think I have the energies in my deck to use. No, I don't. I don't think so. Let's drop these here. We need... What do we need? Oh my gosh, I did have enough energies! I didn't realize that. I need the rescue stretcher as well as... Uh... Yeah, I need the rescue stretcher. And a rare candy. Almost right. Rescue stretcher. Rescue stretcher. Holy cow! Thank you, order pad. Thank you. 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 This is should be game. Lion, come back. I don't know why your friends in the prize guard. Rare candy, you up? Retreat is like, I'm back! I'm back, baby! Hello! That lined up very nicely for me at the end there, buddy. That lined up nicely. Okay, you won the game, but you can go ahead and get two energies back for next turn to kill the next Pokemon that comes out. Finally, some nice good win came my way for the very first match, too. That was excellent. That was excellent. Thank you, my five Pokemon. Dumb eyes, get out of here. We're gonna make you even faster and better now. Baby up front. Valuable Prism Star and Banana Master in the back. Lily starting out with a Altar of the Moon. Not too bad, not too shabby. All right, we're gonna play a light from Fire Emblem Fates, Ryuma's theme. Hey, resist, no, no resistance. 20 damage, uh-oh, don't have a beast energy. Don't have a beast energy. Like, at least he is enough. I was like, oh, well, I didn't know you were. I guess I should pay attention to what color you're playing on. So, all right. So the Prism Star would be nice tanking this. Choice man, okay. And uh, I still can take two hits, so I think I'm okay. Here we go. Well, choice man, Lily definitely turn one. When, love it when those happens. Are you heads? All right, well, this is gonna be a big risk, but I'm gonna load this up. Oh, I'm, oh, you have an attack! You, I mean, you people rarely use an attack, but you still had an attack, though. I was like, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's true. I do have an attack. Well, that's not... A, I'll live then, at least. I'll live then, because that wasn't a beast energy. <laughs> yeah, you can't attack. I mean, Cosmog usually never, ever, ever attacks, but you should really forget about that, so don't do that. If you have a chance to shoot, shoot it. Okay, so, yeah, done it. Now I wish I had the Delmize in my deck. But I could hit this for weakness damage, but still, 
Yeah. Field blower. Oh, I don't care. That, I mean, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's fine. Now, what should come up now? He forgot to attack, too. Okay. Hello, Ludala. He's like, uh-oh, what is this thing? Okay. Well, leaving it be. Yeah, four nest balls. Let's get out the Cosmog and let's get out. You know, we might want to... No, we have a free retreat. We need to start involving our babies. Are we going to use Lunar Javelin? He's like, no, oh, I'm going to use this instead. Uh, I'm going to actually... Well, you know what? Let's lower him up. Let's lower him up. Make sure we can use everything. Glide. Okay, so we both... Well, that's how it is. He's going to smack me pretty darn hard here. Very, very, very hard. So if he puts energies on this, though, he might not be able to attack with this deck. So that's going to be good here. All right, he did put place the energy there. And we're going to see if we'll be able to get this guy up. We have four candies, plenty of order pads. So we might actually... We need that fourth order pad, man. All right. All right. No, I just beat... A Gumi deck with my Beast Box feels good. Congratulations, Dark's Poison. Beast Box. They're pretty cheap. All right. Uh-oh. Professor Kukui is going to hurt pretty hard, but I do have resistance, so... Ow. 130, I'm alive, but he has no other attackers after this. We're going to go ahead and play Cynthia because I don't want to destroy these yet. There are things to destroy, but not this. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now we're going to get putting energy up here. Because I do not need anything big to attack with. And we're just going to use Glide. He has no other attackers. So I'll leave it be right there. And we're going to take another energy. Good. We'll max. We'll retreat the max potion and attach those energies that was lost. Or one of the energies. It only gets basic energy cards, so that DC is wasted. Ah. Uh, or we... Hey! We can kill this! We can just use straight use Lunar Javelin! That's worth it! That's worth the prize cards! I'll take that! Like, why, why are you doing that? This is more valuable, and this also is free retreat, too. So he's got to be careful, because, okay, well, this is a nice threat. That was worth it, then. I take it back. That was absolutely worth it. So Rescue Stretcher going to get that Buzzwall value right after this. Yeah. Actually, uh, you may not want to actually attack with this. No, it's two prize cards, man. It's two prize cards. Do it. And just give him these two prize cards here. Do it. I will. I will. Sorry, Max Potion. I'm going to throw the only Max Potion I have out of the game. And we're going to get a Cosmoan because that guarantees me a new fighter. Almost guarantees me a new fighter next turn. Let me see if I can get another car value of Banana Master here. Banana Master, what you can get for me? I give you a choice, man, Donald. Okay, you can have it. I'll need it for you. Here we go. S Cynthia. Get Phil at the bench. I kind of like that fourth Nest Ball, guys. This is a free. Re this is a retreat Pokemon. This guarantees me that I'm gonna have another a stage two in the next turn. This is smooth. Why wasn't the other one that smooth? Lunar Javelin. I Rushy ninety his sub. Thank you for the sub, I Rushy ninety. It helps. How many DC do you play? No, oh, first of all, dude, it helps so much when you do. You guys do this. I rush. Thank you very much, man. And going to your question, cheesy taco. Uh, I think believe three with this. I rush. Thank you, man. Okay, back to the game. We're gonna send out Sogaleo and try to counter because nobody can really fight after this. All right, so we're gonna put the energy on. We're going to Ultra Ball at this point. We do not need this card. We do need another Cosmog. And we know the energy is going to come back here. So that's why I'm tossing that. And I want, you know, my heavy guns. My big guns to come out. Let's go ahead and play this here. Play the Cosmog. Get Lily. This is smooth. Oh! It's lining up today, man. Turbo Strike. The oh, Both of these all in one deck going together. Yeah! Okay, so now it's like, hey, Donald, get out of me. Yeah, I can loot a javelin next and then take out this guy right here. And like, wonder I? Okay. Okay. Hey, no problem, bud. Yep. All right, Rushy, the, the new emote. I wish we had some more emotes. 
We'll get there. Maybe a couple more years or something. Okay, Rebel GX incoming. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We'll be ready, though. We will be ready, sir. We will be ready, but man, that Rebel GX is gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt. It's gonna bring him to two prize cards. It's like, ah, I can get buzz wall value. Rebel GX! Oh, I love these kind of games. I love these. The Foggy is redeemed. We'll get you after this game, buddy. We'll get you after this game. Setting this out right here. What? You set the little baby out? Oh, yes, I am. Rare candy, this. We could DC that, but we want to see a Requiem GX, don't we? Turbo Strike, knock that out, avenge your fallen ghost bat brother. I don't know, I was making that stuff up. Two Energies Requiem GX is now ready. We need one more prize, guys. We'll, I mean, if he lets me, I have not used Requiem GX ever. I will just retreat and just attack with this. And finish the game right here, man. D foggy, huh? I'll get you the regular status. Let me work on that. Mm. Okay, getting ready to do that. Show you. I'll show it on stream after this. So let's see what move he has here. Let's see what move he has here. Let me get some drink of water here. I think I've got it. I have 270 damage loaded up for the next turn. I have my GX ready. He needs to KO a GX to win the game. His Pokemons are not ready for that. Ryoma is like, Dullet, you got this. You got this, buddy. Finish it off with your GX move. Hold the, hold the card still. There we go. All right, so. Let me get D-Foggy out. DF, D-Foggy. DF Doggy, man. That sounds much cooler. DF Doggy. All right. That's completely ready. So when this game ends, I'll show ya. I'll show ya. All right. We're gonna watch, but we know this probably is the last turn. This is the last turn. He knows it too. It's like, ah, you know, he was exploring his options, looking through ways that he could, that if it could well come, but it wasn't there. We unfortunately missed down Requiem GX, 270 damage, but the game was there. The game was there, good game. MVP, good job, Lunology X. Yeah. All right, well, you can make a back with the, the next box. Sweet, sweet. Well, looks like you made it to the end. Thank you, congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. So let's break it down. Let's stick it to Lunology X. What do we love about you? Well, I guess the whole deck in general, we love your combo. Other decks have it too. You just have more stats, do you? Because you're a stage two. Very tanky for both, very high damage, and I'm gonna give you 4.5 of that because of those better than average stats, stage two. Okay, damage, I'll also give you a 4.5 there. You're not one-shotting big stage two GX Pokemon, or at least the biggest. You can one time, and maybe the weaker ones, but definitely not the 250 ones. So I'll just take a little bit off there, it's still really good damage there. Defense. I'll give you that extra 0.5 as well, because you do have some max motion compatibility, not fully, and you are very, very tanky. These are giant hit points, and they're very difficult to one-shot. And your GX Pokemon staying alive two turns, that's actually something that generally Stage 1 and Stage 2s can only do, so 2.5 there. Okay, actually some attacks may even do three hits for this. Uh, reliability. It is a stage two, however, it felt much smoother than yesterday's deck. On stream, like if you're watching me, that yesterday's deck was much harder. Much, much harder than this one. I don't know. Maybe we just have a better formula here because it was like, oh, you saw everything set up very, very, very nicely here. This combo was just somehow just smoother. Four out of five, I'm giving it better than the 3.5 from yesterday. So, final rating. We're going to tie it to the reliability rating as a 4. It is a stage 2 and you're going to have to fight that. And, you know, don't I don't want to get your hopes up. It's a stage 2. So, yes, you will get the combo going pretty often. It'll work pretty often. But you're like, man, all the decks are just smoother. So, uh, yeah, that is kind of true. There's less overhead. This has a lot of bunch of overhead. But the stats, everything paid balance in the end. Weakness, 
You're always, always with stage two. You're always gonna have to deal with that. And I think that is the biggest thing. You don't really have weakness, weakness. Everything else is kind of, you know, it's kind of the works pays for itself. So, that is that. I'm gonna give you four. And tomorrow, I'm gonna give you a deck that really impressed me. Steelix. Oh, yeah, I'm on this account. Steelix, there we go. So, very honestly, this deck impressed me a lot. It's not one of the Torment decks. This deck tomorrow is worth it seeing. It's very easy to do, and it, I'm gonna leave it that. I'm gonna leave it that. So, time to close this out. Please like, subscribe. I got more good things coming for you. Really good things coming in November. So, uh, uh, new cards are coming out. Twitch. I stream live on Twitch. You just have to follow me to catch along. Well, next Pokemon stream is Tuesday. Uh, Patreon. If you support me on Patreon or Twitch, it helps out a lot. Helps out with everything. So, I thank you everyone who do, does that. And Discord link right in the description covers their iTunes, Spotify, wherever you like to stream your music. So, that is it for now. Thank you, Arnold Scrolls, The French Rules. Take it easy. Stay safe. See you guys next time. Thank you. Bye-bye. All right.